kept the fella hype low key. I ain't got a cap, niggas know about me. Head to the back with my wife in the front, rolling up a fat blood of the good show G. Yeah, y'all better leave me alone. Yeah, I'm in the league of my own. And you better go get them quick, fast, in a hurry, cause your niggas ain't beat me alone. Get from my set, same old. Family, what it do? Yeah! What it do, family, man? It's your girl, Tamika, and I am back with another video. Shout out to the family, s &T Squad, Drip Set, what it do. Whatever you dream, you can achieve. Dreaming really is probable. Drip Set is in the building, you dig what I'm saying, yo. We about to react to this. Lena is done with King after the IG model exposed King's text messages promising to fly her out. Now, um, we're reacting to Voice of the People video and we're gonna just drop our insight. Now, for the people that that, that do not know, uh, King and Lena uh, are in a relationship. They just had a little girl together and um, Neek and King used to date, okay? Um, some of the situation that King is experiencing right now or Lena is experiencing right now is the same thing that Neek was just talking about last night. And a lot of people, I mean, the other night, and a lot of people dragged her for her story time. But see, this is the thing people got to understand. Just because two people share a story doesn't mean that one person can't talk about it. You feel what I'm saying? So I feel like if Neek wants to talk about a story time of her life, she actually can. It's everybody else. If King was not on YouTube, she could talk about an ex and that'd be okay. All right? But because everybody know who her ex is, people get, they, they be mad about it. Now, as you can see, uh, she had every reason to talk about it because it looked like he's going through the same thing with his new girlfriend. So we're about to get into this video and we're going to talk about it. You did. Let's go. Let's see here. I want to make sure I don't leave y'all in the dark. You know how I am, y'all. But yeah, this is this is to me it's a prime example. Can't get comfortable, my nigga. Can't get comfortable. Let's go. Allegedly, there's a young lady with receipts that says she's been talking to King. Now, this conversation, according to her, started in the DMs. But before Lena caught King, King and this young lady was talking on the phone and FaceTiming and sending each other pictures with no clothes on. Now, King originally got caught by Lena, which Lena actually ended up reaching out to the girl, made King unfollow the girl and block the girl. And here's what the girl had to say. See, this is my thing that... This all happened around the time when Lena left. If you could look at the thing, you could see when Lena left or whatever. King hit vanish mode. I wrote him just to see. I was like, hey, you want a friend or whatever? Uh, I ain't gonna say that. Someone is this girl, she sound like she is far south. That nigga King is going deep south to get these females, bro. Cause I ain't Lena what Lena was from Rhode Island or some shit like that, but this girl sounds very country. Hold on, what? And you could see when Lena left or whatever. When Lena King left. King vanish mode. I wrote him just to see. I was like, hey, you want a friend or whatever? Uh, I ain't gonna say that, something like that, just to see. And then he had vanish mode with the eyes or whatever. And he's probably texting me off a text app or whatever. And um, my whole thing was, I wasn't really gonna fuck with King or whatever like that. I just Shut up. Shut up. See, this is what I don't like. I don't like when an outside woman say shit like this. Because if you was not going to fuck with this man or anything like that, then you shouldn't have texted him or you shouldn't have hit him when this girl was gone. Now, I'm not saying that she's the root of the problem because the root of the problem starts in the house. Okay? No woman and no man should be allowed... To do dirt on your ass, you know what I'm saying, or whatever. They're going to always be the problem. I don't care what the outside person do. The key person to making y'all relationship go bad is your significant other. You know what I mean? So you saying, oh yeah, I wasn't really going to hit him. Yes, you was. You dig what I'm saying? Yes, you was. Now you're saying something different because you start catching smoke. You shouldn't have hit that man from the beginning. Everybody got to practice good etiquette. You dig? If you know somebody is with somebody, why the fuck would you shoot your shot with that person? And if that person catches the shot, it's because they didn't want the relationship like you wanted the relationship. Period. That out, you could miss me with that. It was a mistake. It was no, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Because you have ample enough time to be able to go away from your mistake. Soon as the bitch texts, even if you decide to text, okay, you have a choice of not going to meet the person and all of that shit. So I don't blame the outside people sometimes. They might be a problem, but I'm blaming my motherfucking woman that I go to bed with every night. Because you're the only person that can let these folks in. You, me, 
Nobody else. I want to hear that shit. I just did it because I feel like Lena acts like a Danny Lee to me. Just like, you know, you know. I want to see I what she was saying. Them pics, can I get more? FaceTime. Don't be one of them. Um, you don't be. I just can send it to your phone. Uh, my kid up running around. This my phone. Send here. Can't laughing out loud. I don't know. Y'all probably share passwords and this is her. No games like that. This me. We cannot be doing that. I don't trust people. Um, I don't either to send any pics on any on a number. I don't know. Um, I mean, get exactly where you're coming from. Though. I, what the fuck is they talking about? Proof like, be for real. I am for real. I don't know. Come to me. Send what you, send what you want sent to you. Vanish mode. When am I gonna come to me? Okay, motherfuckers can't talk. Just did it because I feel like Lena acts like a Danny Lee to me. Just like you know, you know he got a black baby mama and all this and that. So I feel like, and then that girl that was supposed to be pregnant by him or whatever, who was pregnant, you know, no shade to her, nothing like that. You like wanted to downplay whatever she had going on, like oh. What do having a black baby mama got to do with any of this type of shit? Folks just get on this app and just be talking. Like, what the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Bella Shaz, what you say? I believe Neek should be able to speak on fucking right. Oh, this and that. King was single. Uh, I slid in his inbox because I'm a daddy. I knew he was going to reply. That's the same thing. And then my whole thing to her was, you know, you throw rocks and hide your hand. Like, oh, well, King, this and that. If we're going to be honest, King and Neek started that empire. You just open your legs and had a baby by a man the same way the next could do. I, it was no lies told on a, on a, Bama, on a Bama beauty. You know what I mean? The Bama beauty, she went down right there. She, I mean, it's the truth. You know what I'm saying? Nobody could not deny the fact that Neek and King had an empire. You know what I'm saying? That they started one together through all the hard work. Nobody could take away from that. Now, sometimes I do don't like I don't like sometimes when a successful person meets somebody that's less successful. Okay? Um, just because that person is less successful doesn't mean that person doesn't add value to someone's life. So you can't just say that another person made somebody else. I don't like that sometimes. You know what I mean? When a person get with somebody that's very, very powerful, the first thing a person would say, well, you wouldn't be shit, shit without that person. Well, you might be right, but you're not going to tell me that I'm not worthy of this moment. Nigga, because even though he might have built something right there, I'm working with his ass right now, so I'm just as deserving. So sometimes I hate when people say that, but in this particular case, I feel like she hit the nail on the head. And that's my whole thing. And then you, oh, I'm Latino, this and that. It's nothing to, you know, be happy about your race, but do it in an uplifting way if that's what you're going to do. You know, and I feel like you're not the same thing Danny Lee was doing. So... So that was my point, like, and then me and King, we did talk on the phone. He kept on saying, you know, I don't trust nobody. I don't even do stuff. Trusting is crazy at the time. Damn, we were wait more, waiting for, waiting more pits from you. This is the shit I don't be understanding with grown ass men. He over this motherfucker talking about grown people still do childish shit. Nigga, what the fuck do you think what you're doing right now? It's childish shit. You gonna wait till your girl fly out? To do this, bro? See, this the shit with dudes that pisses me the fuck off. You dig? He in here talking about trust in this whole fucking thread. Look how many times a nigga done said trust. You know what I mean? And then he expect for his girl just to trust him. He expect for us to trust the shit he do when I still don't understand the shit with, with Carmen. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, nigga, you blatantly just lied on this girl. But it's just like, nigga, how the fuck can you talk about trust? Don't play. You know where to come. So she, he ready to just to beat the cheeks off shoulder. Don't know this lady from a can of paint, but about to let this lady risk everything that you have right now. Make it make sense. I don't get that shit, bro. This situation could fuck your whole house up unless you don't want to be no be there no more and you too coward to tell her yourself. 
You know what I mean? So you will let some dumb shit like this happen. But men be so victims that they, 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 they pisses me off. Y'all always the victim when y'all get caught up. Stuff like this, but it's just the principle. Some people need to be humble. Like, and then she was in my, then he answered the phone finally. Off some, those are just half of the messages. He answered the phone and he was like, this me, this me. And then we hung up. And it's, everybody knows King's voice from how he was the name. And I did, I sent him some videos like of me dancing, something like sexy like that to see. And he did send me. But you wasn't really trying to fuck with King like that. But you sending that nigga butt naked ass through the mail. You feel what I'm saying? I, I, how, how, how you didn't really want to, you know, I wasn't really trying to fuck with him like that. But you send this nigga butt naked booty. You know what I'm saying? You live, you little fizz in this nigga through, through the app. <laughs> Give me a picture of, you know, his what? And I'm going to send it to her. You know, I'm not going to expose nothing like that, you know, whatever. But my whole thing is, if I was doing this or doing that, I could have been. So the nigga, so he even sent his dick. Knowing that motherfucking Lena, Neek, and everybody else around this bitch would be able to identify it. <laughs> Niggas are stupid. And you wonder why people don't take you serious, my guy. That f the boy. Sent this, you know, but I'm at work, you know, getting this money. That's what it is. Like everybody, black, bl black women stand up. I just feel like, you know, so many black women get shot, like put up down or whatever because of this and that. And it's just like, we all should be treated equal. Like you ain't no better. Black women, don't, you know, I, I hate when people want to say black. Or you, trust, we got a problem as black women, but nigga, this not just black women. That's all women. And, 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 and she kept making references to Danny Lay. You know what I'm saying? Saying that's what she is or Lena thought she was going to be different. Y'all, I mean, all of that shit to me is irrelevant. One thing I do not like, you know what I'm saying? Y'all drop it down in the chat if y'all kind of agree. Like, I do not like the fact that sometimes, you know what I'm saying, situations like this happen. And the first thing she want to do is attack Lena for what, doing, what Lena's supposed to do. She realized King was doing some fuck shit. Of course, she's going to confront the old, the other woman. But instead of you being mad at, you, you get mad at Lena. Why not get mad at King? As a woman, you should have standards too. So I know not to do another woman dirty because I know what the fuck I want in life. If a girl told me, you know what I'm saying, that she had a motherfucking girlfriend when I was single, you know what I mean? I have to make a choice on what I do. And sometimes when you're making them choices, you're not making them solely for you, but you're making, making them morally. And, 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 and women go back and forth. Even right now with the Young Miami, the Gina, all of that shit. Y'all mad at each other instead of the nigga that is flying y'all the fuck out to do all of this shit. He is the one that got y'all looking dumb and you ain't got no smoke for them. You ain't got no smoke for his ass. But you will, you will go back and forth with another woman. That's getting treated just the way that you are. It makes no sense to me at all. You did? It makes no sense to me whatsoever. Because you this or that. If you really feel like that, you know, uplift, uplift. You feel me? Like, don't be. I feel like you're trying to throw rocks and hide your hand by, you know, want to post up pics and stuff like that, you know, on some this or that. And if you go look, I, I told King, I said, hey, do a video of you doing Lena makeup. That could be a prank. Go look at their videos. Did he not do a video of him doing Lena's makeup? Yo. <laughs> he sure did because I was thinking about reacting to that fucking video. Now, listen, I'm not saying she ain't lying. But what I'm saying is that people be giving these niggas too much credit. You feel what I'm saying? Women love to attack each other over these Dirty dick ass dudes. Swear to God, say that three times. You know what I'm saying? They love to be able to do that type of shit. But instead, you should be attacking the, the, the peen. He the one that's the community peen. And you mad at her. What you mad at her for? I am never going to understand. And I told you, man, that young Miami and that Gina who shit, it got me blow with Puffy. Because they're over this motherfucker going back and forth all night on Twitter. But none of y'all ain't mad at the nigga that got y'all in this situation. <laughs> Same thing with Tory Lanez and Megan and Kelsey. Y'all done lost a friendship and some more shit. You dig what I'm saying? But ain't nobody making this nigga be accountable for nothing. Everybody like, oh, y'all going around each other's backs, sleeping with the same nigga. So y'all don't yell at this nigga for knowing that they was best friends too. The smoke should be the same. You dig? It's crazy as hell to me, man. Y'all stay tuned.
Yeah.